The internet. It runs the world, doesn't it? It can be used for many things, many useful things, like education and entertainment. But it can also be used for some rather strange things. This is a mystery fun box I bought off of a stranger on Facebook. So what we have here is a mystery fun box that we bought off a total stranger on Facebook Marketplace. So I'm gonna show you a picture of the guy that this came from. Kinda looks like that, that Gran Torino guy. Oh, Clint Eastwood, he does look like him. So I'm gonna read a little description of what's in this box supposedly. Obviously that's the fun of it, it's a mystery fun box, so we don't know what's in it, but let's read his description so we have some clues. Our own special blend of two pounds of random items. Some you may find useful, some items you will like, some items you might not like, alrighty, and some we just put in there for laughs, whatever that means. After all, don't we all need a smile now and then? There's so many different categories to choose from for this box. He also gives some more information and says, order from the people you can trust and talks about how many mystery boxes he sold. So he sold a lot of these. So hopefully it doesn't have anything deadly in it. Now I did order this and since I you know, don't know who I'm ordering it from and I don't know what's in it or anything like that and it's kind of creepy, I actually had this shipped to a friend in Virginia to his UPS address, so like it wasn't even his address either, and then he shipped it from there to me. So it's pretty secluded or pretty anonymous uh, that we ordered this, so obviously the seller, oh, and I used a fake name as well, so so there, there was no way the seller knew that we bought this or anything. What name did he use? I think I, well, I don't want to say that because then the seller will know that it was me. Oh. I don't remember. I honestly You'll don't remember the name. you have to tell me later. Um, this box was, I believe, 12 bucks. It was really cheap, so it weighs about two pounds, and uh, yeah. I'm gonna check it. One pound, 14 ounces. Sir. Two pounds. <laughs> so I think, how do you wanna open this? I was thinking that we crack it open, and then we just like, we don't look inside, and we just pull one item out at a time we take turns. Crack it like an egg? Crack it like an egg. It sounds like it's pretty secure. It, like, sounds like there's probably bubble wrap holding whatever's in there. In there. Sounds like it's not loose at all. Yeah. Let's crack open this thing. We won't look in it. We'll just reach in one at a time. We and might pull have to out. if it's all wrapped. With That's true. Though. We'll see how it goes. Oh, here goes nothing. All right. So first item. Kiss me, I'm a dork bumper sticker. Yeah, we can put that on. And then the other thing we got, member, proud member of the chess club. Yes, I love chess. You really do like chess. <laughs> I do. So, I mean, those can be useful, I guess. I know we were talking about not looking in, but that's literally what it looks like. Yeah, your turn. Oh, I take out the big yellow thing? Yeah. Ooh. Oh, it's a Ooh, bag. This could be useful. For groceries. It's a nice, one of those like reusable. recyclable, reusable bags. All right, so off to a good start. Ooh, pirate stickers. That's pretty awesome. What the? Aviator glasses. <laughs> they look pretty nice, actually. I mean, look at those things. Oh, oh they're even polarized. Wow. Don't hate, you keep your stickers. That's right awesome. There. Oh, I, I, I looked. I was looking to grab whatever this is. This is heavy. That's what he does. Ooh. Whatever it is, is metal. It's a car? It's like a... I wish it was chocolate. It's a car of some sorts. Look at that thing. I wish it was... I mean, this can definitely be useful for something, I guess. <laughs> I'll wait until you figure out what that can be useful for. <laughs> Next, what is it? A box. A box. Ooh, that would be an good for organizer. you. Organizer. It's an organizer. It's got a calendar on it. Oh, it's from 
1999. <laughs> nice. Look at that. Planning calendar, 1999. Awesome. Oh, it's got 2000 and 2001 even. Look at that. Boy, that is very useful. I think it has a wallet too. Oh, and yeah. a wallet. Yeah, it's a wallet. Wow. Good fun. Next, hanging garden. Ooh! This is my kind of garden, too. A jalapeno pepper garden. Oh, that's why it's your garden. So you can grow jalapeno peppers in this plastic thing. Oh, we got seeds. Look at that. Oh, no. We got seeds so we can grow jalapenos. And I guess you just hang it like this? I don't know, we're gonna have to learn the directions. Oh, you fill it with soil, okay. You fill it with soil, and then you just hang it, and the peppers grow. Pretty cool. I actually might use that. You probably have to wait until what? it starts. It's like it's down until the plant starts coming out. Oh, then yeah. You hang it. Yeah. Well, pretty neat, I guess. I'll take that. That's a good, that's a good item. This. Ooh. It's a pen. It's like a survival pen. It's got, it's got like the survival Craftsmanship. rope. Rope. And it can hook to your keychain. So it always hooks. Definitely a cool find, made in China. Shocker. That goes with my organizer. Yes! We got a Yankee Candle car freshener. Look at that. And even all of the juice seeped out of it. I don't think it's supposed to be juice. <laughs> it smells good, but... It does smell good. There's something wrong. Maybe he put that in there for a reason. What's that? USB LED lamp. Oh. That's more you. I like to that live in the dark. He likes the light. USB lamp. All right, so I guess it looks like it plugs into yeah. a USB port and then it's just like a light. I always wanted a lamp, so. I never get him lamps. <laughs> I, think, I think this is the last item. Oh wait, no. There's a couple more. Hot deals. Bag. It says hot deals and it's a little a little bag. A little pouch. A little pouch. Let's see. It's a hanky. Alrighty then. What's the point of that? It's like one of those like little microfiber oh, screen glasses. screen or glasses thing, I guess. Yeah. I don't know why it says hot deals. Two ninety nine compared to four ninety nine. Look at that. What a deal. That's why, that's a hot deal. Yeah, that was a great deal, I guess. Is there anything else in there? I think there's one more thing. It's like Another Ooh, air freshener. Another air freshener. This one is so we can be liquid also leaking. We can be liquefied together. That's it. That's all that was in the box. So, uh, yeah, I guess moral of the story is if you want to do something fun, order a mystery box on Facebook Marketplace off a stranger. Do it at your own discretion, though. You know, obviously, be careful. This guy had some decent ratings, so that's why I decided to just do it. I thought it was interesting, so I was like, what the heck, for 12 bucks, I'll take the shot. I had no idea. And, uh, yeah, Pam had no idea until I told her the story. That seems to be a thing, a common thing nowadays. <laughs> So anyway, yeah, we got all this great stuff now for 12 bucks. Let's go party like it's 1999, right? I wish that we had like, they like wrote stuff back then. I know, that would, that would have made it cooler. Like a time capsule. It's kind of worthless. Alright right, guys, thanks for watching. Keep on dreaming and... I gotta go take a shower. I have ketchup in my hair. Yeah, Pam has ketchup in her hair. It's not even low enough that I can lick it. <laughs> I would try if I could. <laughs> Keep dreaming, you crazy little dreamers. And maybe one day, <laughs> the other dreamer will be out. Okay. Bye. Good job. That's my dream.